Okay, so the way I do this is first line up three alkenes. We'll choose the simplest one, which is ethene. The polymerization is addition. So what that means is the double bond, the top of it breaks and an electron goes each side. So half the bond goes one side, half the bond goes the other side. An electron each side, half and half. Now this carries on hundreds, thousands of times to make a polymer. The monomer, the beginning unit, is called, in this case, ethene, and polyethene is the multiple units put together. I've put square brackets around the repeating unit. The IB wants you to know three polymers to do with addition, and this one here is chloroethene, or the old name is vinyl chloride. So once again, erase the top bond and put half of it to the left, half of it to the right, and continue adding, this is an addition of polymer after all, adding the alkenes together. So the old name is polyvinyl chloride, if you started with the vinyl chloride monomer, or if you use chloroethene as the monomer, it's the same monomer, it's just a more modern name, you get polychloroethene. And polyvinyl chloride is PVC. Again, the square brackets represent, oh, represent the repeating unit. Finally, let's look at polypropene. So I'm drawing propene out in a kind of distinctive manner. Uh, and let's use the shorthand version here. So I'm going to put the repeating unit in square brackets. And so the propene, the monomer, I'm going to use N of those. And I'm going to make N of these repeating units. N is just an arbitrarily big number. OK, finally, can you name this alkene, halogenated alkene, and name the polymer that it could produce?